Uh, this is exercise 7.1, question number one. It says in quadrilateral ABCD, clearly we can see that. Oh, sorry, ACBD. A, C, B, D is what a quadrilateral where the length of side AC is equal to AD. Well, AB bisects the angle A, right? That is angle C, A, B. That means we have these two angles as equal. Bisector is what it means. And then we have to prove these two triangles as congruent. So what we need to prove is this triangle that is AC, ABC, right? Is we need to prove congruent to this our triangle that is ADB. We need to prove these two triangles congruent. So in order to prove the two triangle congruent, these two congruent, what we are going to do, let's say first consider the triangle. This is... Uh, will be writing in triangle ABC and the triangle ABD, we have a, AC is equal to BD, AC is equal to BD and that is given. Further, we can see that this angle, this angle is equal to this angle, that is angle CAB is equal to angle DAB. Uh, this is also given, right? Because I have written here what is given. And then we can see AB is equal to BA and that is common. That's a common side. So now we can say that these two triangle, that is triangle ABC is congruent to triangle. Now the triangle is ABD. Well, this is congruent. As you can clearly see, this co is congruent from the property side angle side. And once the triangle is congruent, they are asking what can we say about BC and BD. So BC and BD are the corresponding sides of these congruent triangles. So we can say that BC is equal to BD. And we also must write down the reason here that is uh, CPCT. That is corresponding parts of congruent triangles. So this is how this question is proved.